What's up guys, Narda here, bringing you guys a 50 gun streak here today with the EM1. The variant I am using here in this video is the Poner, and it is a really, really solid gun. After they got done with the patch for this gun, I thought that this gun was really, really bad. But seeing to how I have used it now, I honestly would say it would make it onto one of my top 10 class sets of all time in advanced warfare is a really solid gun at close range is really good at medium range and you can still get a pretty few solid shots off at long range and since i don't actually have a commentary topic for the day i'm gonna just go ahead and do this as a best class set video and honestly what i rocked in this gameplay was hink sink and quick draw and quick draw actually felt as if it was a waste of time because i mean as you guys can see i never really aimed in ever this gun has magnificent when i tell you it has really magnificent aim um from hip fire the hip fire is really really ridiculous i would strongly recommend using this gun this gun is really really strong and um for perk one i ran lightweight lightweight was really really beneficial for me in this gameplay and second tier slot i believe i ran blind eye yeah that's exactly what i ran was blind eye um for obvious reasons because you know noobs like to sit back and try and camp and get all kinds of weird kill streaks and for perk three slot what i ran was I ran hard wire and blast suppressor because I don't have to pick up ammo with this weapon and it just honestly regenerates and is really really strong as long as your shots are on time you don't have to worry about it getting overheated if it overheats that's why you would want to run heat sink and I just ran constant UAV this game that was it like I didn't run I didn't even bother running system hack because I've noticed here guys people have been rage quitting more and more when I get system hacks so I said screw it. That's also one of the downfalls of this weapon. Certain problems is you can't shoot through glass with a laser which I could probably understand. I mean it seems to make the most sense really when you really sit down and take it in and think about it. And I really feel like this gun is very under the radar type weapon. Like not many people feel that they should use this weapon. Um, I know I've been killed off streaks by many scrubs using the EM1, but quite frankly, I feel like the EM1 is a solid weapon. Really, I thought it was underpowered. I never really got to use it while it was overpowered. So now I'm actually going back and trying it. I'm trying a few different guns in this game and i'm really starting to find myself liking um a few of them but i still feel like some are slightly underpowered in the game like and i still feel like the game is really still dependent on the battle and the asm1 and most people would agree with me and some would disagree but i mean i really think i have a strong argument here when i say only viable guns in this game that you're certain to win a gunfight with is an asm1 or a bio as I get gunned down right there, that was really, really sad, guys. I also dropped 100 kills in this game. I went like 110 and like, I believe, 7 or so. Sorry that it doesn't show the scoreboard. Well, I think I'm going to extend the gameplay so it will show the scoreboard. Because I did go 50-0. and 0. Um, It counts up on the side, but the game ended before it could count all the way up to 50 but yeah, look guys, I went 110 kills non-lethal. So if you guys did enjoy this gameplay, please remember to drop a like here. And your boy Nerda is out. Peace, have a nice weekend, and enjoy the rest of your day. Love you guys, and goodbye.